Hey everybody, how's it going? So Hot Toys came to SDCC this year and they brought some really great looks at various characters and various moments from Avengers Infinity War and Avengers Endgame, to say the least. Of course, a big one a lot of people are talking about is the kind of figures of Hulk and also Iron Man respectively holding each of the Infinity Gauntlets they held with regards to either doing the final snap against Thanos or bringing everybody back in the blip. Now this is really cool just in detail with all of the, you know, just the, the fine attention given to each figure. It really gives a great look at how each, I guess, suit that the characters are wearing, just certain aspects about the characters that usually concept art, like nuances that you don't really get to see in full detail all the time until the finished product of a movie. It's all in full display here. So we get really great looks at tons of characters, but one in particular I just wanted to highlight is Iron Patriot because little details on the suit I thought were just really cool, especially if rumors that we're heading towards a Dark Reign type Marvel Universe are true. Chances are that Iron Patriot as an armor will likely reappear in the near future, which could explain maybe why they decided to reintroduce the armor at the end of Avengers Endgame versus simply just having a more upgraded version of the War Machine armor. So on the Iron Patriot armor, as you can see here with the rocket on the right arm, totally loaded with a lot of new weapons. And then we get to see, you know, like the Air Force, you know, kind of tag on it uh, amongst a few other things. And then at the base where it says Avengers Endgame, stuff like that, you can see a little bit of like a patriotic kind of American flag like style, presumably to represent Iron Patriot. But yeah, this looks pretty cool in the background. You can see Tony Stark with the Infinity Stones, Thanos, and you can see Captain Marvel. What are your guys' thoughts down below? Do you guys like this Iron Patriot armor, or do you prefer the one we saw in Iron Man 3? Leave your comments down below, and if Norman Osborn were to actually appear in Phase 4, as rumored by a lot of people, and we get Dark Reign, Siege, all that stuff, would you like to see him as Iron Patriot, or do you still want Rhodey, who presumably is currently the Iron Patriot, to keep the mantle and use it for future films? Let us know your guys' comments down below, and we'll see you guys later.